Hello again, dear friends. Uh, this time I just want to show you an overview about some props that uh, I'm interested for my builds. Uh, for example, here I have the HQ prop uh, 9050. This is a 9 inch uh, carbon composite prop. This one, for example, I got from Banggood and it's an APC. I don't know if it's original or a clone, but I got it from Banggood. It's an 11 inch uh, propeller, 11, uh, 47 actually, which I got for my hexacopter project. But like you'll see later, they are not so good. This one, for example, it's a 10, uh, 45 prop from, uh, from Hobby King. It's not so bad regarding balancing, but uh, it, it, vibrates so much at least on my on my flip fpv and this one the last one it's again a 1045 plastic prop from banggood which seem to be uh, just a little bit stiffer than this 1045 from from hobby king okay uh, actually i have already opened a bag so basically what i'm trying to see is uh, to, to look uh, how well balanced they come and how well they can be balanced with some uh, with some help of some tape yeah. each one can use different tape this one is just for for adding some weight so first of all I just want to go through the APC because this one turned out to be completely unusable so I'm not sure if this is clone or original APC props but they are so terrible so this is how the prop looks to me it's a really soft kind of plastic so they don't impress me at all okay let's just put them on the prop balancer so it doesn't matter the size of the adapter I use I just Let's say we choose this one. Okay, we put it in. Okay, let's open the my trustworthy Dubro Pro Balancer. Sorry about the buzzing, it was the autofocus. We just try to put everything in manual. See how it performs. Okay. So this one is an APC 1147 right out of the bag, not the box. As you can see, it's it's hub imbalance, so it's it's heavy on one side. This one, so the blade is balanced more or less. As you can see, it sits yeah, with a bit of tape on this side. It should be no problem, but it's hub heavy, let's say, on one side. And, and if you look carefully, you can see a lot of uh, material on this point. Let me zoom in a bit. Yeah, you can see a lot of material here but uh, just to be honest uh, I try to put a lot of uh, hot melt on another APC prop on the opposite side so all of them are exactly like that so really 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 terrible let me take it out and 
let me put another one I already play with as you can see this is unflyable so I would not fly with one of those because it's so much material on the side but despite of that it's still hub heavy so I don't know how these guys make the props but they, they're just terrible so personally I will not uh, recommend any of those from Banggood website 1147 so called APC props because they're just really really terrible so just avoid these ones yeah maybe other types are not so bad but this one is just unusable yeah? I, I, I got uh, maybe 10 of those for my hexacopter project but it's just money thrown out of the drain So see how much material I have on this side and it's still going up so it means the other side is too heavy so if you, any, if you guys have any other ideas just let me know because I don't know what to do with those and uh, just the idea of having thrown out the money it's, it's yeah, useless so you see how much material I have on this side and it's still not good so, complete waste of money. Okay, let's just see uh, other type of prop. These ones are from, from Banggood. 45 okay this one is not up imbalanced it's just uh, heavy on one side so with a lot of tape on this on the upper side of the blade it should be working okay let's see this plastic greenish blade from Hobby King yeah, if you have a low KV motors maybe maybe this one work sorry but on for example Sonic Sky X221 to 980 KV motors the RPM is too high and uh, the the tip of the blade just vibrate like crazy so I have a lot of gel on my Mobius okay Yeah, also imbalanced so again a bit of tape on this lighter side should should help so this one was the color 1045 from Hobby King and now let's see I'm really curious because I got this ones uh, the HQ props today in my mail after a long trip since uh, uh, the address on them was wrong, so I barely got them before being sent back to Germany So I'm really curious because I see many people just putting them on the on the blade uh, Balancer and they were perfectly or nearly perfectly uh, Balanced so I'm also curious Let's see how they perform Okay, I need an adapter just quickly. It takes one second. So this come in pairs of two. Okay, let's see any adapter. I wish I get the one right for my sunny sky. Okay, snug fit, I like it. Okay, let's see now. If I'll be happy or not. Because with these other props, it's it's all about compromise. Yeah, you pay less, but you get also less in quality. And when you get a lot of gel in your video, you know why. 
Okay, moment of truth. Okay, looks really good so far, so it's right out of the bag. Perfectly balanced, really, I cannot believe it. It's really, really like I've seen some other people having the videos, just, just good. So personally, I don't think I put any tape on this one to adjust because that's added just extra mass. So the prop stays like you put it. Yeah, really nice. I'm happy. So if you need good quality props, this is one of the brands that uh, worth the money. It's called HQ Props 9x5R. So they come in sets of two, clockwise, counterclockwise with the adapters you need. Okay, that's the good one. Uh, the bad ones are those. As you can see here, said advanced precision composites. So APC or clone, whatever, these are really rubbish. And this one are cheap plastic ones from Banggood and uh, they're very similar to the ones from Hobby King. With some, some tape and some adjustment, they should do the trick. Just uh, want to see the weight I have on the the prop from HQ, as you can see, it's zero, 6.0 grams, precisely. So I say that's not bad at all. Okay, I hope uh, this info helped you keep some money in your pocket regarding my recommendation on props. And uh, also, maybe I help you decide on the HQ props, which seem to be really nice props and well balanced out of the box or out of the bag. So, having this in mind, I want to thank you for watching and uh, please subscribe and uh, see you next time. Bye bye.